Hey guys, and welcome to another video. Today we're going to be opening up caskets. Just a random ass item I found on the wiki, and I have no clue what they are. Uh, I looked at the drop table. We have a quick look here. Uh, it seems pretty good because the price of the caskets really aren't that expensive. We're, we paid about 1,180 coins each, and almost all the drops, except for the Cosmic Talisman and the Uncut Emerald, and I guess the coin drops are not going to be worth it. But everything else looks like it'll be profitable. That being said, the coin drops could screw us over pretty hard, but this is just for fun. It's not really a money-making guide or anything. It's just kind of my own curiosity and uh, wanting to just open these up and see what we get. Uh, so we were planning on going for a thousand, but this has just taken a long time to buy. This has probably been two days, so we're going to pull the offer out and see how much we paid for them. So for 654 casks, we paid 758k. And if we have a look in our bank here, Okay, so we've gone ahead and cleared out pretty much all the drops, um, just the emeralds and the jewelry. Uh, we got 656 caskets right here. And, um, well, let's see, Cosmic Talisman. None of those. And loop. Okay, got some tooth halves and loops halves. We'll have to get rid of tooth. Okay, looks like we're good on that. So we'll just sell this off, and then our bank should be cleared of all the items we could get. And all we're going to do is open them up. So we'll do a couple test uh, inventories and just see what's... <laughs> we'll see how we're going to... How close it's going to be to profiting afterwards. Uh, so we'll go ahead and withdraw uh, an inventory of caskets. Uh, price check them. So the caskets are worth 31.8 mil. That's saying about 1.139 each, which is actually a bit less than what we paid for them. Anyway, let's open them up. 80 coins, yeah. So the coin drops are going to be a bit of an issue. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, so we got some emeralds, cosmic talisman. What we're looking for is a loop and two half of key. Another cosmic talisman. Oh my god. Alright. So that's an inventory. Let's price check it and see what it looks like. Alright, we lost 8k on that one. Well, let's open these up and see what we can expect to get. We're going to keep the coin drops in our inventory. Uh, I think we might actually lose money on this, but uh, <laughs> who cares? All for the greater good. Anything from this inventory? Eh, rubies. At least the caskets open up pretty quickly. No rare drops, unfortunately, yet. Alright, we'll go ahead and open up the majority of these and come back and see how much we actually will profit. And by profit, I mean lose. <laughs> All right, we're just finishing up the caskets, and uh, I really don't think I'm going to even break even. Uh, but here's why I thought it would be profitable, and this is why it is not. Um, so we'll just finish up the last, last of these caskets quickly. I only have like eight left or something like that. It looked pretty promising, and but the problem is the coin drops. So yeah, pretty classic inventory. Um, so all these gems are profitable. But the problem is the common coin drop is not, it is between 8 and 3,000, but I kind of thought it would be, well, like a 50-50. So most of the time you'd be profiting, like, it would be any random number between 8 and 3,000. So more than often than not, it would be profitable, because the keys are 1,200, and uh, you'd only need 1,200 coins or more to profit. So I thought, no, oh, that's pretty good, you could get anywhere between 8 and 3,000. That is not the case. Clearly, it's much more common to get lower denominations, and that is why this is not ever really going to be profitable. Uh, that being said, we did get a couple tooth and loop half of the keys and diamonds, um, but from all 600 and whatever coin drops, we only got 64k. Um, we got four tooth half of keys, four loop half of keys, 31 rubies, 94 emeralds, 166 sapphires, and Eight diamonds. So you can see the rough rarity levels there. And uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and do a little price check here. Let's see how much we p paid for these things again. 758k. <laughs> Don't think it would be anywhere close. Put in the diamonds, rubies, emeralds, sapphires, rubies, loop halves of keys. 639k. So we lost about uh, 120k. Could be worse, I guess. Um, so yeah, opening caskets, not profitable. Was kind of fun, though. 
we'll go ahead and sell all this off in the GE. Uh, so this kind of video today was just, I had these things buying, I was going to make a video about it anyway, so I just thought I'd open them up. <laughs> Clearly not a very profitable way to spend your time, um, but you're better off just selling the caskets. So I've now pretty well checked every single chest in the game. Uh, beyond the muddy chest, so we might go have a look at that later. Um, but yeah, that's about it guys. I know it's kind of random, uh, weird video, but I was kind of curious and I thought you guys might be as well. Maybe you didn't even know the caskets existed. So we sold everything off. 629k, we're taking a 130k loss. Oh well. Alright, hope you guys enjoyed and there should be another actual video coming soon. Mm -hmm.